there's a hunger growing deep in the pit of my stomach. A hunger so great it's been festering for longer than I can remember. The world trampled under the boots of oppression, pushed to the brink. All it takes is one little push. We need someone, something, to give it that push. Push towards chaos, towards a new world order. But there's just one last thing that I need to do. I've been waiting for you. <sighs> That's stupid. It's a good line, I'm just not delivering it correctly. It doesn't sound, doesn't sound menacing enough. I've been waiting for you. Yeah, that, that better. Gotta get that right. I've been waiting for you. I've been waiting for you. Well, I've been waiting for you. No, it's stupid. It sounds like I want him here. Don't make eye contact. I've been waiting for you. No, now you're looking around like a fucking idiot. Maybe I, maybe I should turn like a pivot. Yeah, that's always very dramatic, right? You see my back silhouette. I've been waiting for you. And that's not really working on this stool. I've been waiting for... I've been waiting for you. Been waiting for... I've been waiting for you. Oh. Ugh. Burns. Maybe I need like a weapon. Like a gun. Yeah, that'll make me look menacing. Hey Siri, what are some good evil villain lines? I've been waiting for you. No, I don't want to hold a gun. I'll leave that to my henchman, Yoke. Guns are dangerous. You're the worst evil villain. Hi, Mom. It's me. Do you think I'm a good villain? I, I, I don't get why going to college would make any difference. Yeah, I know Kyle's a doctor. But I mean, I have my own laboratory. Yeah. <laughs> Sick. Where is he? He should be here by now. I've been waiting for you. Maybe the lasers got him. <laughs> oh, those lasers. Those lasers never work. <laughs> Hello? No, I don't want to know my credit score. Hello? Someone there? Can't even get two minutes of privacy. Okay, tell me. 1999? No, thank you. I've been waiting for you. No, that's not it. Maybe I need another drink. I've been waiting for you. Eh, it's pretty good. I've been waiting for you. I've been waiting for you. <laughs> Stupid. I've been waiting for you. No, 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 no. I'm trying to put together a PowerPoint to outline my evil plan and I can't even get the font to format correctly. That's why your wife left you. The first one, the second one, that's on her, I'll give you that. But you don't want to lose the third one. She's a keeper. Always gotta be the villain. Always gotta be the bad guy. Everyone always says, you're always the bad guy. No matter who you meet, no matter who you talk to, you always gotta put on this act and this facade. But what if I don't always wanna be the bad guy? I mean, I have that choice, don't I? Maybe I should- Warning, perimeter breach. What? Oh God, no, not now. <sighs> okay, <sighs> now or never, you got this. Like the gentle fall of the sands of time in the hourglass. Like the ebb and flow of the ocean tides with the moon. For at last, after our long journey we meet. I've been waiting for you. I know, man, I know. It's I was here like 30 minutes ago. Most people just want me to like leave the pizza at the door, man. Yes, well, I am not most people, and my instructions put you through my gauntlet of challenges that I would make any hero go through. Yeah, man, no, and I appreciate that, but I made like 
$8 an hour, you know? So like, I don't want to be going through henchmen and the floor of lava. And you had sharks mixed with bear, like bear sharks or shark bears or shares. Like, I don't even know what you call that, man, but they had shark heads on the bear bodies. It was wild. And then I came in and I had to play Simon. I don't even know where you found that game, man, but that was definitely not a nightmare that I needed back in my life. And then on top of it, some dude rolls up in a suit. He's like, I'm a doofus. I need to save the world. I need to stop the bad guy. I'm like, bro, delivery is not that serious of a business. Relax, man. I forgot. I completely forgot about him. Oh, I've been so worried about you all day and showing up and you're late and I just haven't even thought about him. That's right. Oh, I'm so unprepared. No, no, man, he's dead. Like he's, he's, he tried to open up the door and then a laser beam just shot him right in the beak. He's like, Phew! and he's like, I'm dead, help me, save yourself. And I'm like, bro, I don't want to get fired. Wait, wait, did you say lasers? Yeah, man, laser, that's what I'm telling you, bro. <laughs> Never work. Those lasers never work. <laughs> you see, <laughs> man. Do you want me to just leave your pizza here? Like, uh, you do realize I have to kill you now. What? Why? I have been waiting for.